My name is Rhapsody, his name is Rito, and welcome back to Ian's End. Expedition mode. How's it going, bud? It's great. It's expedition mode. Uh, it's story mode, but we, <laughs> you know, we're doing, it's a campaign mode. There, let's say it that way. It's a campaign mode. I... Yeah, it's a campaign mode. I'm, I'm certain they would have served us some text earlier, but it might have been skipped if it was a little long. I don't know. I don't, I don't it's know. It's a story mode without the story. It's exactly. <laughs> it's going to be a campaign mode. We get to unlock characters and stuff this way. I mean, I'm excited. And I'm also happy to see that the four mages we pick from here are not either of the ones we played last time. That's kind of nice. Mm -hmm. And we're going and to... In fact, I will even say one of them is the one that I'd already like earmarked as mentally that's the one I'm going to choose if we were doing the main Ooh. mode and they just so happen to be here too. Well, you want to, you want to go ahead and pick them then? Uh, I'll just take, I'll take whatever's, I'll take and one of the three so that's left, I guess. Absolutely. Oh, I am taking a uh, Sahala. I mean, I like, uh, I like the whole vibe there. This is actually it's a tough choice. Vibe. It's true. The whole galaxy. I mean, oh man, I got to go with Claudia. And then mm -hmm. our, You've had magical arms before. Yeah, I'm. it's old hat. Old arms. And then we're going to up it to normal, I guess, which basically just means we have less health. Monster has more health. That's that's basically it. Oh, mm -hmm. my God. Nest mat. A oh. new mechanic for whatever this enemy is. Upon filling, mm -hmm. Gravehold suffers two damage and hatch a fly. Upon filling... Interesting. I wonder if we have the ability to target it at all. So I, I yeah, I don't know. Oh, the players lose the game at the very top. Uh, huh. Ah. Do we have to play things to it in order to keep it full rather than empty? I'm not Maybe. Entirely certain. I, I have a feeling we will find out. I think it's the stand-in for whatever the, the rage mechanic was the last time for that other mm -hmm. enemy. Maybe, I'm, maybe the cards will just say add one to this thing if you don't uh, give me your firstborn you know as as games tend maybe to do they they are very very commonly asking for my firstborn my yeah. firstborn is just popular amongst games at the moment yeah, um, yeah, yeah i only have four sections required for my power which oh, is yeah. starbind activate during casting or main phase reveal the top three cards of your deck place a spell reveal this way into your hand if there are no spells prepped to your celestial breach prepped up to two spells in your hand your open celestial breach what on earth so i have a final oh, breach here which is different to my other breaches called the celestial breach which does two damage on cast and it would be able to utilize that ability interesting that so is, seems nuts it is! It is, especially considering we also start with Sparkling Meteorite, gain one ether, or gain three ether, sorry, aether, uh, that can only be used to focus or open a breach. Oh, okay, okay. So you can't, yeah. If, if it, I mean, if you didn't watch the last one, I guess it's maybe going to be wild anyways, but yeah, aether is the stuff you can use to either buy stuff from the shop or open up your little spell portals to cast spells. But that is... that one is basically... So yeah, you start out with the same opening hand every time with each character, which, which is interesting. They're like, this is your opening hand. Your five cards you'll get in your mm -hmm. opening hand every time, and these are the five cards that'll be in your deck in this order every time, which is really interesting. You could really just find a uh, a perfect strategy and roll it. Hope, But it just comes down to the ordering of the enemies. It's, it's, it's very neat. The style in which RNG comes out to play is different than other games. It is, especially because you can manipulate it with things like this, the recurring Jasper, gain two ether. If the top card of your discard pile is a spell, so on play, if the top card of your discard pile is a spell, you may place this gem on top of your deck. So it's like almost a better version of the one that we had last time that was purchased to the top of the deck. Yeah. I'm not sure if I should take that or the aether conduit, attach this to any player's breach. Uh, when the spell, sorry, when a spell is cast from this breach, the player who casts that spell gains one aether. I worry that that will just disappear as soon as I use it to attach to anything. I, I can't imagine it would. It'd be too bad. It would be, but how many deck cycles until every single breach has this on it? Oh, I see what you're saying. Like, I, 
I, I do think, never mind, I do think that when you attach it to something, it will stay there. But I guess mm. you're under the impression that, that that will be bad because it'll take far too long to get the value back. Yes. For, yeah. For, ter- for yeah, so uses whether or not to get it's... the value back. Is a lot. Yeah, whether or not it's an investment play or an execution play, effectively, in my mind. Um, I'm going to be going with the, the four-cost recurring Jasper because I think it's a good idea. Yeah. I'll play my one damage to my open breach, take my recurring Jasper, and then in discarding my cards, I'm going to discard my best card first, and then the rest of them after. Your turn. Is it? Oh, you think mm, I'm, the, you no, think I'm the him? Bosses. They disorient us with that. Sorry, I apologize. I'm a little disoriented as a result of this attack. <laughs> yes, it does yes. unleash on their behalf. Any player suffers one damage and discards a card in hand. If the card is a gem, our grave holds suffers two damage too. Oof. Also, when they unleashed, uh, they added a fly, I think. Like, that. two things just filled up over there. In the little... Yes. Yeah. So that's their unleash, It almost I guess. looks like they added two, though, that's weirdly. That's what I'm Because there's... Hmm. I wonder if we can target those individually, right? Because they're a oh, fly, right? Oh, they and have one got... health, yeah. Yeah, we might be able to ping them like that. That's I think I should suck this damage so you have maximum money. Go ahead. I'll... I'll it... cool. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna stand in the way of that. Okay. On you. No, actually, this is the enemy. Okay. So what? Are, what is my thing? Okay. First of all, uh, activate during any ally's main phase. Ally gains two aether. The next time they gain a card from the supply pile, you gain a copy of that card from the supply pile, or they gain five. Huh. Wait, so I, I give you two Aether, and then if you buy something from the shop, I also get that card from the shop in my mm-hmm. deck. Or I can just give you five Aether. I'm just a helpful little son of a gun, huh? Exceptionally. Right. And then gain one Aether, or an ally may lose a charge. If you do gain two, if they do, you gain two charges. Huh. That's uh, super cool. You, All right. you also might notice you don't start with any open breaches. Oh, that's true. I got I got nothing. I mean, well... Okay, I guess what's the thing? Gain one or... I mean, you don't have any charge, so I guess that pretty much just... That settles that. So, But I start yeah, with exactly. five to play with. It's kind of nice. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's good old Imbued Smash. Deal four damage. You may discard a card in hand. If you do, do two damage to the Nemesis. Uh, hmm... I don't hate the idea of an attack that has multiple pings to it, since there's this business mm-hmm. over here. I don't hate that. That being I, said, I, I think, think the second ping is guaranteed to go to the nemesis. Yeah, I, that's what I was about to say. Is I it would be a lot better if it was in the reverse, if it was two mm. and then four to the, but uh, three damage if it was cast from open breach and three or four deal one additional damage. Yeah, two damage if there's cast. Ooh, wait a minute. This might be something. Deal two damage if this was cast from an opened three or four breach. You may place this into any ally's hand. Mm-hmm. That seems maybe nice. Like, I, I feel like if this does become an issue and we can attack it, which I guess remains to be seen, uh, mm-hmm. the ability to just have lots of instances of a little bit of damage seems incredible. Uh, very, very true. What else do we have? Just focus any ally's breach. Or cast any player's prep spells. You may destroy it. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Sorry, I was just... uh, I was just going through these here. Probably should just go for mana as of right now, but... I don't know. If this becomes a big deal... Like, I don't know what hatching a fly is going to do, you know? Maybe it's terrible. Mm Mm-hmm. I imagine that will probably get a minion on board that we have to fight that's a bit more powerful than the eggs there. Worth, no- worth noting, I have one card that does damage, and it's that little dinky spark. Okay. So I- I'm very mm. much supportive. Because uh, hmm. I feel like the Jasper may not be quite as good for me. Maybe I'll just go for this granite right off the bat then. And then I could... I don't know. If- Why would I focus, though, right now? Hmm. 
I don't know. Maybe I maybe I open because I don't have an open. <laughs> I don't even have an open one right now. Maybe that's actually the way to go now that I think about it. Um, you would be able to focus or do anything towards that next turn. Uh, it's true. It's true. It may harm trajectory though. Yeah, my my question is because so this is a uh, uh, number four, mm. and this is for open three or four. Yours is. Is your really special one in number four? Your okay, your special one is in number four. I don't so know. my specials are in number four, and that four cost in the store as well. Uh, the three and then one. Uh, this one. Yes, it says it will deal an additional damage if it was done from a three or four breach. So for me, it does two additional damage by base and yes. one additional damage because it's in a four. So it's a six and a four. So I'm yeah. going to be buying force amplifiers and trying to open my breaches. That's like the opening I've Yeah, done. that seems... So, okay, it's also... But does it apply the bonus damage to the additional damage? I know that last time it did, yes. but it said that in parentheses of that last card. So I was one, I'm was i wondering if the phrasing additional damage means it won't apply or not. The parentheses in my mind were similar to kind of like a magic cards parentheses where it will explain the regenerate mechanic, but regenerate sure. is still a keyword that affects everything else. Okay. I mean, I'm down with it. I'm just, just taking a little bit longer on this first turn to just get yeah. re custom here. I'm, I'm probably just going to go for this and, and uh, oops, go for that. Go for that. Sure, sure. Scoot. All right. Mm. Just got to reacquaint. Unleash twice and any player gains two charges or grave hold suffers four damage. Uh, I mean, how much should we really be sacking health all right, already? But if, uh, I mean, we, grave hold is going to suffer two damage regardless. That if we is allow true. them to unleash, that's happening. Because if uh, if unleashing twice spawns two per unleash, is it actually is it genuinely going to add four? Like, is that really going to happen? That seems kind of nuts, actually. It's not, it's not clarifying how the unleash mechanic individually occurs. Yeah. But but last time it did one and it summoned two, so you would imagine. I'm down to I'm down to take four damage to not risk Great. four summons. If it's if it was two oh. summons, maybe it'd be different. Oh, it's me again. It me. Oh boy. Uh, at this if you'd like to, you can open a, a three or four breach. That's what I'm kind of just thinking is just probably best to get use out mm. of that. I like it. I like it. Now, let's see if I can target this to one of the flies. I can yeah. indeed. There it goes. Good, 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 good. It appears to be an egg for a fly rather than a fly itself, though. Uh, yeah. And then the rest of this... I, I'm one short of being able to open... <laughs> yeah. Or focus towards the uh, final breach, unfortunately. And are uh, you thinking probably not even worth? Well, I mean, you could start working on the three, I guess. Even though the four is cool and neat and better, but it's not. I guess it's not stupid to open the third one. I guess it's not. It's certainly not. Yeah. Mm. Obviously, it's it's one of those situations where it's oddly unsatisfying, or slash oddly unsatisfying to go for that one instead of the four, but. Alternatively, we need to econ anyways. I wonder if maybe the best econ available to us is galvanized bubble. Mm. I could you see could it. do that. Are you thinking we should even? Are you thinking we should break our one our one damage pings though? Like, in any other circumstance, I'd be like, yeah, they kind of suck, but I don't know. Do you think it's innately worth... Oh! <laughs> I don't intend on breaking them. Okay. I just want to open all the focuses. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. I was just wondering yeah, so if you were... We... You're saying it's econ okay. because it's cheaper to open the focuses, not because uh, uh, you, for the casting spells. I mean, but it, can, it can pivot into casting spells after we've opened all the focuses. Gotcha. Just making sure. Exactly, especially after the point that we have, you know, the, the threes yeah. and fours that we're backing, passing back and forth and things like that, at that point it'll make more sense. Yeah. Here, I'm kind of happy to ditch one of these, because if we are right and unleashing yeah. adds two, then this would keep us from... Oh! <gasps> oh! Yes. Okay, we can totally...
totally destroy those pings. <laughs> never mind. Yeah. Okay, never mind. All right. Well, that changes everything. <laughs> it does. That changes absolutely everything. Uh, you know what? Whatever. Why would we? Why would you not split it? Because like, does it just waste the damage? Feels like it. I don't. I guess I don't know. Because if it's like do two so damage to this and overflow, I get. I don't know that. We'll see. Maybe it just wants to make it clear that, like, you know, it is individual creatures in yeah. these slots because that'll matter later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have so much money. I have a lot of money. But, yeah. All right. Okay. Okay, okay. Well, that, that changes everything. I got to kind of re-equate <laughs> again. I don't really have... Okay, I don't really have spells right now. I could get the spells... Tethered darts, solid now, still. Uh, yeah, force amplifiers. <laughs> force amplifier, but for you. And since I'm kind of like more of a supportive role here anyways, is there anything here that like generates charges quicker that I... Because that could be... Wait. Any ally may discard a card in hand. If they do, that player gains a charge. I mean, that is nice. It is. Reveal the top three cards, play spell. I mean, I'm down with that. Yeah, I think it's a pretty good buy. Yeah. You feel, are you going to, you think you'll be viably able to discard cards routinely? Uh, yes, because I'm not going to have any way in this loadout to destroy my uh, base gems. Once I get online with having spent effectively all of the money that I need to, half of my deck is no longer valuable. Yeah. <laughs> Oh dear. Wait, what? Uh, to discard, we would have to spend six power. Uh, so it'll occur in three turns, play three maggots into play, and any player suffers three damage. I mean, we could suffer that. It's safe. true. Are are the one the little one pips, are those maggots or are those eggs or larvae or like These are maggots, I think. They believe, are maggots? Yeah. Yes. Uh, so I just put the top card in my discard pile uh, as a ping spell. So I'll now play the recurring Jasper, putting it top of my deck. Let's go. Hmm. So that leaves me with a total of five up to a total of possibly eight. Damn, I'm one short of being able to just open breach three, which would be good. Hmm. Will the focus costs increase as I pay it? The focus should decrease, shouldn't it? Mm, I might focus two times on the full Celestial Breach then, if that's the case. It either decreases or it stays the same. I, I don't... It, it doesn't go up, I don't think. Unless I'm crazy. It's good enough for me. All right. Let's go. Not wrong. Not Get wrong. Him. Let's go. <laughs> Real deep worm. I mean, As a that's... persistent effect, any player suffers one damage each of the enemy's turns, and Gravehold also suffers one damage. I mean, I don't like it, but... Not a huge fan. Okay, you have no prep spells, so I can nope. focus one of your breaches for you right now. Would you like... I mean, I'm just going to assume you want Probably the second Probably the good the one, one yeah. Has damage. Uh, I'd like the yeah. good one. <laughs> oh, right. Oh, picky. <laughs> I okay, want the fine, nice one. I want it now. I want a chocolate <laughs> river. Want it now, Papa. I want a chocolate river with a man stuck in a tube. Boy man. <laughs> Why do I <laughs> get a chocolatey man in a river? I want one of those squirrels. <laughs> squirrels. <laughs> Wait, the recurring Jasper. So I have the ability to get up to a total of three this turn. I think I'll use that for another focus and get another spell out on the field. Yeah. Or, uh, I don't know if I'm even going to be allowed to finish off Fly Throng here, right? Am I going to be able to spend three on it? No, you have to spend all so. six in a single turn. I'm kind of of the mind that I don't really care about that right now. That I... makes sense. Yeah.
Perfect. On you. <laughs> oh, what are you going to do this turn? <laughs> Please help me. Hey! Please you deck can builder. open a focus right now. Please deck builder master. I'm so confused. <laughs> Order of operations. Action economy. Oh, no. Uh... Okay, you just have to follow the foil <laughs> method. First, outside, inside, last, right? That's... <laughs> The order in which you First, play them. Outside, inside, and turn. Oh my god, oh my god. The mouse <laughs> is glitching around. Oh my god, the mouse is glitching around. I actually almost end my turn. Oh my god. Is your mouse on screen or something right now? Is it? Uh, I, I haven't tamped it off, but I will do that. Okay, I want to see if it if that makes it not glitch. It does. It does seem like it solves it, for what it's worth. Easy. Yeah, I can do that. All right. Oh boy. Um. What's okay? Click a mage's life indicator. <laughs> mm. uh, the, how about the worm? The worm. It's highlight highlighted. Do we have ways to heal ourselves up eventually? Uh unlikely. Yeah. I imagine there's probably like special effects in the game that can theoretically do it, but it's probably not going to be a common effect. Yeah, I'm not seeing that as an option for this here. I mean, I'm willing to take the hit unless there's something I'm missing. Like, just evensies. You know, uh, I'm not even waiting. I... Okay. <laughs> I want to be hurt. I probably should have waited, but it felt like the polite thing to do. It's so... It's all good. Okay, what's going on here? To discard, discard three cards in hand, power one, play a maggot, and then place two flies in play. That feels Ooh, not great. That does feel not great. If you have something you think you can do this turn with uh, your Rubidium as well as your Geostone, so your five and three cost cards, this might be a good turn to get rid of that. Yeah, I'm happy to ditch my, my lower <gasps> stuff. What's up? This is a huge greed play, but if if you want to absolute boss your way through this, you could <laughs> discard three cards, generate three ether, uh, six ether, and then discard the other power as well, preventing the enemy from doing anything. Ooh, ooh. It, Wait, so how much do I have? Oh, if I break the extra granite, is that what you're saying? Yes. I'm down to do it. I'm down to just like make it so he doesn't get to play the game. Hell yeah. Excuse me, sir, this is solitaire. Nah, this is mine. Uh, wait, what? Oh, do you want to discard a card to, to gain a charge? Um, or no? Yeah, actually. Crystal? I think that's super valuable on me. Uh, it, it should probably be my ping at the moment. The spark? Yes. Thank you. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, bonk. No playing for you. All right, your turn. Hell yes. My mouse is yours. <laughs> Hilariously, uh, I am again one short of being able to open my final breach here. Uh, okay, I do want to start working against this minion because it's just going to be it, persistent and stay yeah. otherwise. It sucks. I don't like it. I don't like it. Uh... Ooh. What I could do this turn is pick up the force amplifier in preparation for opening the focus next turn. So what are my other... Like, this is literally my next hand, right? Two, three, yeah. four, five. I get a total of five. That's not enough. Although I would be able to focus it. Yeah. But then would you What do you think? It? If you, I mean, you're not going to draw it the next turn, though, right? Like, because you, you would draw no. this, and then this would go on the bottom. Yeah, the, the four would go mm -hmm. on the bottom, so you wouldn't be able to draw it next turn. So, I, eh, I don't know. Like, it's, it, it'll feel very bad, though, if you do open the focus, finally, and you don't have a spell, like, pretty quickly. That's, exactly. that is a pretty big loss of, like, ten. So, I think that it might be worth playing slightly suboptimally to mitigate the chance of such a dud turn yeah i i agree i think you're right. i think the amount that it would feel bad is worth more than, is more than anything to reduce mm -hmm. <laughs> oh buddy you aren't even ready for this 
Hmm. Wait. Uh, hang on. Undo that. Was the final card I put the top card is no. Rip. Rip ready pieces. for it. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I will... Excuse me? Does that not allow me to focus your breach? Yeah, what's going on there? Excuse me? Focus the breach, please? Uh, focus my breach, please? Oh, it's immediately making the choice to do it on that first breach because there's no other available target. Oh, it's just being nice, but is isn't mm. accidentally being confusing. Exactly. Discard a card in your hand if you do two damage to the nemesis. Oh, Imbued Smash was the one that had the... Yeah, suboptimal, run it. Imbued Smash was the one with the parentheses, wasn't it? Uh, that, yes, yes, it was. Yeah. Okay, so then it's probably just not... I don't know, it's, it's, it's one of the... It's the card game thing, freight... Like, just a one little... What? Uh, wait, what's happening? Wait, what's going on? What is this hand? Oh, why? What the... Wait, what happened? Well, I have every spell I've ever had, ever. Yep. Wait, how much is it? Uh, um, what? He's a flying to play, and he plays stuff as three damage. I mean, I'll take it if, unless you have some reason to. We can just alternate. That's yeah, all good. <laughs> oh, God. I think you need a good spell in your deck. <laughs> First, outside, inside, last. <laughs> and turn. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I need I need a spell. I I guess I guess at this point I got five. I, I mean, imbued smash works if it was open in three or four. Do extra damage. Okay, so th this did get put here. Is it just a does it just have two health? Is that the whole thing? A fly just has two health? It's, that's what I have to assume, yeah. That's all it is? It's the same thing, but with two health, I guess. All right. Um, oh, my. I'm thinking I got five. What does my thing do? Uh, activate during an ally's main phase. Ally gains two. The next time they gain a card from supply. I don't know. I don't know. Eventually, I think your ability will be a good way for us both to get just the seven costs immediately. But that, I don't think it needs to be used before that. Yeah, that's why I'm... But I'm wondering if I'm like, should I just go tethered darts plus two, slowly work my way there? Like two damage if this was cast from open breach, three or four, you may place this into an ally hand. Like, I mean, that could be nice. Yeah. I don't know. Like, we'll probably often have that breach. But the question is, are you going to be... Are you going to have room in your breach for that? Because you'll probably be putting a double ping in there. So maybe you won't really want to be putting that there. So maybe the presence um, of tethered darts is maybe bad then. Because you'll want to be, you'll want this open. Like it's going to be a while before this is open. And you're going to want this prepped for one of these two, theoretically, right? Like theoretically. Theoretically. So I feel like going for this just doesn't make any sense. Uh, you know what? Maybe I should just get the bubble. Because it's going to be... Maybe I go all in support for you. You know? Maybe that's... I don't think that's an entirely awful idea. <laughs> I mean... I mean is it, on a scale of 1 to 10, how entirely awful? Because I know oh, that... sorry. No, it... <laughs> My hesitance is because uh, it's an idea that does sound good for me. Well, uh, so me agreeing with it wholeheartedly becomes... I, <laughs> my character is very clearly intended to be support. Yeah. So I think that me not playing that is me being selfish. <laughs> it's like, I'm going Soraka and I'm mid. I, You know, that's for the league, <laughs> you know. I'm sure you get it. That's the league heads in the crowd. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I don't know. She, maybe she's a... She might be a freaking 80 carry now. I don't know that game anymore. She throws deadly bananas. Oh, my God. He knows. Oh. All right. I'm down. <laughs> Hell, yeah. Oh, it's me. Oh, <laughs> me, again. me again. Me again. Me uh, again. Ooh. Wait. Yes. I'll we do that. Yeah. I feel like... And... Wait, what? 
Yep, I'll lose my charge. You gain two. Okay. Good deal. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy, yeah. I, I, I mm -hmm. thought that was the other card, the other one that I started with. That's why I got confused. Okay. Uh, bip, bip, bip. Bip. Hmm. 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 Which one's first? Which one's outside? <laughs> well, <laughs> inside last. Uh, misplay. Okay. Yeah, total, total <laughs> misplay. Oh my I'm god. Just the stout. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, mm, mm. I. You, I don't think you need a second. You know, probably not. But. <laughs> I can be wrong. It is kind of funny. Like, I don't know what... I guess I could... I could, I, I could get this prepped and ready. I suppose there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, ally gains two. Next time ally gains a card from the supply pot. I mean, like, there's nothing wrong with having that at the ready for, like, a worst-case scenario where either you, A, desperately want five uh, focus or five aether, or mm -hmm. you are about to buy something very cool, you know? So just having that at the I, ready seems fine. So I like that, but I I worry that <laughs> immediately next turn, I would actually probably pivot to argue that we should use it to immediately gain five so that I yeah. can cast all of the spells in the same turn. <laughs> I mean, is that that bad? It's not bad, no. I mean, I'm, I'm down with that. That doesn't, that doesn't bother me. Getting all of our focuses ready seems like kind of the big thing. Oh, it's me again. <gasps> uh, it's you again. It is me again. Focus and allies breach or cast any player's prep spell. You don't have a prep spell? Oh! Uh, I'll, I, I can prep a breach you for can, you. You can open the final breach. I can. It's been broached. It's, it's been broached. Should I... Okay, here's the question. Should I still be going for this guy because he's a real piece of trash and we are slowly, slowly dying? I'm at six health and the man can do um, three? So the only way that really prevents much from him is if he takes both actions before I take... Uh, no, if he takes... If I take one action before he takes both of his. So it is, it is possible that that helps. That's what I'm... Yeah, because I mean, you got. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I'll just do it. All right, I. Oh, you ready? Are you ready? Yep. Let's go. Uh. Erudition. Do you want to discard a card to gain a charge? You have four spell. I feel like three yeah. that can be only. I, I should. How much does that, this that, cost? That costs three, I believe, to focus. Um. Which means I could use the entire hand. Yeah. But I don't need to. Oh, no, wait. Hang on. It, would you gain the charge or would I? Uh, I think you gain the charge. Oh, okay. Because it would be wasted on you at the moment. Um, I'm, I'm fine without it. Yeah. First. Oh, first. That's the same. Inside. Okay. Uh, six. Boy. I probably should... I should... Probably get a spell someday. Mm. But Especially with all these open folky. <laughs> the old open folky. Do you have a mm -hmm. do you have one of these, by the way? Uh, did you ever did I you do. pick I up do a indeed. bottle? Okay, then yeah, I definitely should have one then. Uh and you're gonna have four open folky. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> you're gonna have four open folkies. Yeah, I'm going to be doing the open folky hokey pokey. The open folky hokey pokey. Put the damage in, you put the damage out. I feel like <laughs> I feel like I'm in on force amplifier focus cuz I just don't really know what else at this point. I'm doing it unless I you like yell it. At, unless you yell yeah, at me. I think before that's a really it. efficient expenditure of them. OP folky. <laughs> Turn yourself about. Uh, <laughs> no, OP folky. <laughs> Oh, great hold. Alright, uh, I'll cop this. Alright. No! Discard and seven. To discard, spend seven Aether as a power in three turns. Uh, if there are 
seven or less total flies and maggots, place three and one maggot into play. Otherwise, any player suffers four damage. Should we just like, hmm. maybe we should just let that happen. I think if that, in three turns, we'll probably have the damage to deal with that. Right? Yes. All right, that's a good idea. Oh, oh. We're a battle mage. Wait, Warning. I can take more actions? You have your thing, thing. Wait, what? I'm allowed to take more actions, apparently. Oh, With you what? can use my you you can use my power if you want. That's what it is. Oh, right, right. Yes, yes, it counts. No, we weren't going to be doing that. I let's end don't anyway. Think so yeah. All right. Oh, <laughs> let's go. Hang on. Uh, yeah, that's seven. That'll be seven. Oh, oh my god, we can do it this time. I mean, um, yeah, we can do it. It's fine. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, cool. Echo, Sorry, echo, echo, I just echo. had something uh, caught in uh, my. You <laughs> <laughs> sound like you were uh, like somebody broke into Michael your house Ford. and was uh, stealing you away from the chair, but you were still so excited about the uh, mm -hmm. about the seven. <laughs> Wait a second, please. <laughs> I'm talking about please, cards. Not, please don't kidnap me. I need to let him know. <laughs> uh, three. If it was cast from an open deal one edition. Plus two damage on cast. Oh, right. Yeah, this might... Yeah, this one might not double amp. That's what I was... Because it might just be one additional. This. I think you're right. That's what I was Oops. worried about. I'm sad that I bought that one now. Oop. That's okay. It happens. It's so okay. damage. It's okay, Foki. Six. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Are you trying to shoot me? Uh, we're swinging towards the fly for a second yeah, there, yeah, but yeah. I think we might be okay. Uh, then recurring Jasper will go back atop my deck as a result of this. And I can... You have nothing prepped, so there's Opie no reason pokey. not to just open that focus for you. Exactly. Oh uh, God, total misplay. You I'm played gonna... them all left or right. <laughs> you played all three of them Ooh, left or right. <laughs> I'm sorry. I haven't played in a while. It's my bad. To get both of us a uh, pattern strike, deal four damage. You may return up, to, uh, sorry, to your hand up to two cards in your discard pile that cost zero. Nice, nice, nice. And then discard that first and move. Worth noting, it'll probably be good for you to have one charge every once, like every fairly often, then, because mm -hmm. I can just keep on redrawing my. Uh... Oh boy. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, that just immediately activated. Oof. Oh, God. That's a lot of flies. That's a... That's a lot of flies. What's that? The grave holds at 18. 30, I don't know. I don't know. Is it really... Who cares? Okay, I don't like this, though. Mm. Oh, and you don't... Have... Oh, no. Man, is there no um, way to discard cards? Or, or destroy? We have no thin decking? No, we can destroy spells with the uh, the galvanizer that we have, and Bad. we'll probably pivot towards doing that a little bit. But I, yeah, that 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 explains why this is like this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, first, let's see. Let's see. last, first again. <laughs> I... it's, it's the foil. F if, if you haven't an, another, like, immediate thought, I don't. that five cost that allows you to discard to do two different pings, that one we know does yeah. amplify its damage two times. And it seems like the most efficient damage for going directly to the face, which we may need to start doing. I, I think that's true. And also, like, the double ping over here, I wonder if we can... Oh, gosh. Yeah, because we, we can do four here, like, overflow up on a bunch of them. And then do two dir directly, too. I mean, yeah, mm. I, I, I like that both ways. It, it helps us. This, I think, is uh, Force Amplifier is dead to me. Uh, Imbued Smash is my new best <laughs> friend. Ah, oh, that's ah. me. Uh, Opie Pokey? Opie Pokey. <laughs> Turn yourself about. Okay, deal three damage, we cast from three or four, yeah. 
ally may discard a card. Gain a charge. Do you desire a charge? Are you fancy little boy who desires a charge? Yeah. Yeah, I think I do, actually. All right. Yeah. Drop me a normal crystal. Because uh, my spending next turn is almost certainly just picking up five for the... Uh, the, the five cost spell that I can't remember the name of right now. Yeah. Righteous I Fury. Probably something like that. Uh, wait, which. This is three or four. These are both. Okay, we're good. Yeah, you just don't have a one. Yeah. All right. Um, hmm. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, at this point. Okay, so I have. I've got four. I could. Do I need the Opie Fokey? I feel like, I mean, maybe. What do you got going on here? You've got a Galvanized Bubble coming up soon. Is or wait, is this this is the oh these are the top. Oh heck, mm. never mind. You'd have to go twice. Well, actually, you are gonna go twice. Mm -hmm. You're gonna go twice, but then you can cast my spell. So you cast my spell and not Opie Fokey. Uh, so so maybe, maybe maybe I do Opie Fokey. <laughs> Turn myself about. Get myself ready for later. Yeah. I'm down. Whoop. Um. There you go. Yeah, work, work. Wait, what's what's going on with that spell up there in the upper left that we that I totally forgot about? What's going on with that one? Mm. Oh dear. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> that. Oh well. That's. I forgot. I'll tell you, that's a problem. It says spend seven if there are seven or less flies and maggots total. Play three flies and one maggot into play. Otherwise, any player suffers four damage. And we have two flies and three maggots. So currently it will be uh, three flies and one maggot, which I believe will be bad. <laughs> Seems ungood. <laughs> uh, hmm. Well, we do what we can because we must and all the rest of it takes care of itself. I'm going to be taking up a 5 cost here. That's the best thing I can do that turn. And then discard the Jasper first. You next? Well, that's not great. Mm. What? Uh. <laughs> uh. Hmm. <laughs> Uh, you know, let me just point out, there is a world in which six get played, we just, we literally lose next turn if he, is. If he rolls first, because <laughs> you don't have any spells prepped right now. The best that could happen yeah. is you play mine, which you will be able to, right? No. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you will? Uh, On the cast, I will be able to play it. So at the start of my next turn, I will get one of your spells. Mm, yeah, but that might be. It, it, there's a world where that's too late. That sucks. But I'm a gambling boogeyman. I don't know. No, don't oh, know, <laughs> Mr. President. No, it, I could not do it to you. You probably you should have. <laughs> I am a I support. <laughs> we we both have the similar life. <laughs> Does it? Okay. Uh, okay. I think, man. <laughs> yeah, me too. Guess you'll just go there. Do you want that? Wait, is that? Do, uh, but well, hold on. Oh wait, right, because this Double. one will do the extra damage in that. This one won't. No. Sorry. Total misplay. Oh good. <laughs> it's, uh, okay. 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 There's a. There's hope. There's hope. There's hope. Uh -huh. What's going on with this? I didn't even. A glimmer of hope. <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> Can we not? Uh, Gravehold suffers five on that. Suffer two. Hatch three flies. Mm. 
yeah, this is. I mean, I could just ping little like a little one over there, and that's something. Or I could, I guess, I'd ping a two, huh? Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. We just have there's problems everywhere. <laughs> Everything sucks. Everywhere's scary. It what stinks? It stinks. What do you picture as the biggest threat right now? Because I, I can't kill this this turn anyways. I think at mm -hmm. least some of the damage should go over here. But the question is, how much are we willing to... Well, two things. A, how much are we willing to, to risk it over here? B, does this proc again every time it it goes back over the threshold? Because that... I don't mm. like that. I don't like that if that's true. Because then it's almost I like... I think we should send probably both of those to the Gravehold's defense. Over here? Yeah. Yeah, I think so too. It's a bummer. Okay. Uh, wait, how much does Get this do right now? This does... Wait, is it doing four then? Is it actually, is it just, do, is it only doing It should doing be four? doing five. Is it doing five? Okay, so mm -hmm. it's doing three plus one plus one. Of course. Yeah. Okay. I mean, do I get a pick? Please use it well. Okay. Yeah, you do. And they have to be in the same section, it looks like. Okay. Do they? Yes, they do. Nice. Okay. All right, well, fine. Well, fine. First, I said, oh, well, mouse, hello. Oh, now it's hello. Oh. Well, oh it's okay. the moment. I guess I am. That's all. Okay. Oh, thank you. Use your both plus one. Okay, fine. Click or drag a card down to... Oh, you're... I was just saying that to me. Okay, whatever. I know that. Oh, boy. Oh boy. At this point, I I don't know. Maybe tethered darts are fine now. I think Maybe, they are. I think that we need like everything. I think I just need a spell. <laughs> I'm gonna ask because I don't take the damage. <laughs> oh no. Uh-huh. What? 17? 17 damage we need to deal? Well, at least you have a lot. Yes. Yes, indeed. So this is going to be 3, 5, 6 total by itself. And then this one over here is just going to be 1. This is going to be 4. So 6 and 4. Uh, I can go 6 and 4 to take out the Vile Breeder with only one overlap. I mean, it seems fine to me. We we really can't I take can cast one of your prep spells without destroying it. What are my prep spells right now? I forget. Uh, they're both really good. They're the two highest cost spells in yeah. the game: Imbue, Smash, and Pattern Strike. I mean, yeah. I mean, uh, yeah. So I'm gonna start out by trying to get rid of this vile breeder. Be gone, vile breeder. Uh, casting phase happens before we can play any of our own cards, so I have to cast this early, which means I might not get much useful back from it. No, I do still. There we go. Yes. Uh, and then this final one, is that going to matter in its direction? So you're doing, with this, five damage to a single target, and... Actually, hang on. Yeah, wait. that's five and five for both of yours. Wait, is that... It, wait, how... Is the one on the right doing five? Because it's in a plus one spot. Is it four? You may discard it. Does it let me discard? Oh, it, the damage would go to the nemesis. I mean, yeah. that's, that's nice, though. But, like, yeah. All right. It, it definitely is. Not to be understated. Yeah. Uh, I do have two committee. zero costs that I would be able to pull back from the discard. So I would actually be able to get myself up yeah. to another reasonable amount of focus. Possibly buying another imbued smash, even. I actually quite like that. I'm down... The clowns. Play my spell. You gotta drag it from over there. 
Where do you want this one to go? Do you want this to start targeting the portal guardian so that you have the ability to deal with it next turn? Or I, should it go for the... I, I feel like it might be important to get that out of the way. I, I, it's so tough because we can't burn 38 that fast right now. And we are on such a timer. Like, if he does something that's just like... He has a, had a card that it was just do three damage to a player. So there's a real possibility like we lose in two or three turns so i'm fine with it mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i only need a total of five so i'm going to take that as well as the extra spell and then i'm going to not destroy your pattern strike <laughs> thank you <laughs> oh you no are problem. oh you auto cast it and i don't get a cast it god gotcha that's less good than i thought it was but that makes sense it would be kind of busted otherwise I think I, I'll take this one. Uh, oh Sorry, city. I mean, I have absolutely it has to be grateful. It has to be. <laughs> Sorry, Ooh. city. Yikes. Uh, oh, man. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Happy to. I'm uh, sure. Well, I mean, we gotta we gotta burn them. Alan may mm. lose charge if they do. You gain two charges. I mean, yeah, you down. Yep. I, I don't know if it's gonna matter, but that that ally. Oh God, this turn sucks. <laughs> I mean, that was handy, but boy, <laughs> boy, this is looking like a. Big old L. Um, yeah, it's okay. I think we've got it. Okay. <laughs> there, there's a world. It's just we're not making that much of a dent in here, and there's a big dent in you. <laughs> you, you are dust. Mm. You are, you are just like the. You're just like shoes with feet yeah, yeah, yeah. and a little bones sticking out comedically, I like am... in, you know that scene in Shrek. With the I'm night. I'm not fully cooked pasta in that I am all denty. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Oh boy, three. Th I mean, do I just take the darts and smile at this point? Like I don't even know anymore. I think so. I think I do, and I think I just say, "Oh shucks, man." That's not. I great. think we just need to be reliably casting as much as we can yeah. every turn now. Bounce. Okay. Uh, so this one I'm going to use to get three of these maggots away. Uh, and then... Mm. <laughs> None of it. No, no play feels that fun anymore on this one. Just to... It doesn't feel great, but like, I think the writing's on the wall. We gotta blow them up, or we blow up. I'm gonna remain in play. I don't want that one. Yeah. Uh, yes. Yeah, I definitely want to do just as much damage as is feasibly possible. That in that slot, unfortunately, is the best for me, which then means I can't put you, this in an open slot. You could focus. Because this gets oh. two damage on two different things. Does yeah, it have it to, has be to be an open? open. Unfortunately. Ah. Um, Ooh. man, Starbind is a pretty good ability for me. Maybe I just put two into that, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. Maybe I'll stop stealing your stinking points. Yeah, maybe maybe that's the big thing, the big ticket. Maybe we should have tried to abuse that a little bit more. Oh, uh, it's me. Okay, you... it's a me. Mario. May discard a card. If they do, they... I mean, maybe. Let me think here. Three, four. Is there anything else I can even do? No, just... Sure, sure. Focus an ally. You want, you want to breach... 
prepped or a spell prepped or a spell cast? I might do better with the breach being prepped. That's what I was wondering. Because, like, it's going to be your turn anyways. If I had, you know what would be nice is if I could cast yours, like, going for the needles that or the darts, casting mm-hmm. yours and then continually giving yours. I think that is a, a way to make that happen, Cap'n, but, you yeah. know. I'll just... Especially because this is like expedition mode. So these are like specifically set for yeah. this enemy, this set of mechanics and stuff like that. So uh, maybe a uh, a future could possibly look at the, uh, the supply and try and figure what we might be able to do to generate like that with one another. Yeah. Do you want to discard a card to gain a charge or nah? Like, a, do you want to ditch a one mana to gain two mana basically? Um, could I ditch the, the middle, the relic? Because I don't want to trash either of your spells. This right, right here? Yes. You, you down with that? Okay. And I can't focus your breaches because you have none. Yeah. No, no OP Foki. Oh, wait, I already have, I still have four. Wait, I could, oh. Oh? Maybe? Does it matter? I think we might just need density of damage to continue increasing, to be honest. Yeah, I was trying to wonder if that if that would help us. If you gain five, is there any world where that helps? Not really. All right. Oh, God. Yeah, the tethered darts would be really fun if uh, maybe if we had it set up a little bit more and we had a little bit more reliable draw order, like, pre-planned out for the mm-hmm. galvanized bubble, so it would be a little bit cleaner. So it's like you need to get it this... Well, I guess, I guess this would be the turn to get it then if we wanted it to be drawn at the same time. We go tethered darts. Yeah, you'd go tethered darts, galvanized bubble discard first i guess that would work hmm? what do you think that or force amplifier at this point i'd probably just go force amplifier yeah. just for larger yeah. initial damage it's like five damage when it's in the three or four because it's got the three plus one plus one all right oh boy i i will wait hold on Oh my god. Okay. Just making sure the <laughs> making sure the mouse glitched. Oh, okay. Uh Oops. Oh boy, none of these are that great. I feel like Do you think there's any situation where we can get down 33 by by just burning right now? It's a little It's looking a little bad. I... Uh Yes. You you think there, there's uh, basically what I'm saying is should we even bother over here at this point? Should we even bother right now? Or like Let, I have I have a two popper. Let me bother over there. I think. Okay. Oh boy. Okay. Now I've got three. Mm-hmm. The perfect amount. The perfect amount for tethered darts. Perfect amount for, for what? Perfect amount for what? <laughs> Is it perfectly wrong amount? It feels like unless... What do you think? Uh, Yeah, I'd, I'd probably go tethered darts. So I I try to think of this game uh, along the lines of... You know, the, the others I mentioned, Cryptozoic Deck Builders and Dominion and things like that. And the kind of, like, pivotal elements where you want to turn. And once you have as many breaches as possible open, you really want to be able to try and utilize all of those breaches. So suddenly yeah. spells become so much more powerful. Uh, so I'm thinking I'm going to use the Imbued Smash in order to straight up just kill three of the flies over here, as well as deal three damage to the boss. There is the extra oh, little I could one. only do it. Wow, I could literally yeah. only do it to the top one. I don't That's know if it would then start helpful. to overflow down or what, but I don't think it would. I don't. I'm not com- confident to say that. What? But would could we rewind? Is no new information is being released. New information would be released. Okay, I didn't know if that would technically. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, it's just player order does it. You know what? Screw you. Yeah, I don't know. And again, click the, uh, card, click in the card discarded. Do I? I have to discard. Oh yeah, for the extra the mag. Um, that's a little bit annoying because I was kind of planning on using my ability. 
Should I use my ability? Reveal the top three cards of your deck. Place a spell or reveal this way into your hand. If there are no spells prepped to your... No. Okay, that's not... Wait. Do you even have... What are the top three cards of your deck anyways? You have you have three cards in there. You could you could know exactly what they are. You don't even have a spell. You don't even have a spell. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> so, yep. there you go. There you go. <laughs> that solves it. It does indeed, especially because this sparkling meteorite gives me the three to finally open this, and now I can cast them in their best positions. Uh, maybe the smash goes there. He's only got 13. Uh, there's a chance. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You're saying there's a chance. Who prepped spells? I mean, I this one for me. I mean, probably send my needles, right? Or wait. I think so too. I think so. Yeah, because you're going next. You're going next. I mean, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I mean. Uh, wait. Did we miss out on? Did we just miss out on lethal? Because he ditched that card. No. Did we? Did we? No. No, no, no. I think so. Wait, yeah, uh, depending if I would have if I would have gone first next time or before they did, then we maybe missed out on lethal. Oh, but if you play both these prep spells, he only has three health left. So if you go before he does, we win. Mm-hmm. That's what it's down to. And also, let me let me definitely say I wait, what? What? What's going on here? Oh. I think it was trying to resolve the end of you may prep up to two spells that you draw, but I didn't. No, why? It's, that's fine. That's, that hasn't harmed us yet. That's only... <laughs> that sucks. Ow, my back. Uh... Owie. If, uh, if you go or I go next, we win. Yeah. It's yes. literally he can't go before we go. That's that's the Sta only thing. Statistically, it's a 66% chance we win. But I'm trying to think if there's really like what I can get my What does that minion do again, sorry? Uh he is going to place two flies, place two flies which okay. is annoying, so but it's not going to kill us. It no. Wait. No, it wouldn't. Okay, no. it does 5 damage to our grape hold and then we would be one fly yeah. off of losing. Yeah, 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 yeah. But depending on whatever he does next turn, we might lose, probably. We're not definitely dead next turn, but we are probably dead. If he does yes. just does damage, then I can take the hit and it won't really matter. Mm -hmm. Uh, Okay, I'm just really trying to think if there's really no other way to do this right now. I don't think there is. Ally may lose. You don't even have a charge. I just... Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Sick. Uh. <laughs> uh. Okie dokie. Okie, yeah. okie pokie. Uh, I don't want to know. Hey, I don't want to know. It's a 25% chance they go next. See? Like that. Wait. Wait. Kill him! Kill him! Kill him dead! <laughs> Kill me! <laughs> I can't believe it! We did it! I told you, bud. I, well, yeah, you did. Congratulations, you've destroyed Magoth. The expedition carries on. Oh. <laughs> oh, Why does it say the one to help you? It's a grave old Zen 2! <laughs> Oh, all right. We did it! Let's go! It, it almost gave us story. Yeah, no, it does. That does, there is none in that. We are, we can't be expected oh. to. No, no. And also, there, it looks like we unlocked this character. Who gets to play Rio? Oh, you can you can play Rio. I was I was pretty interested in uh, Gygar as well. Mm. He comes with a giant oh, hand, so. But <laughs> yeah, it's actually the hand. The the dude is just an accomplice. Yeah. He's just he's fluff. He's limped hanging around in that hand. Yeah. Gygar, the mountain's father. <laughs> oh, I think I versed him in Dark Souls too. Yeah. 
Gygar the Mountain's father and his and his best friend Eric. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's spelled with a K, so it's still suitable for a fantasy world. Yes, yes. E R I K U E. Eric. 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 <laughs> Yo, yeah. That's uh, that's Aeon's end. The expedition. My name has been Raps. His name's Meet and Rito. Hopefully you all have been enjoying yourselves and hopefully we'll see you all at some point. <laughs> Bye.